Hello fellow engineers and welcome back to Stacklands. This is a city building strategy survival card game. Yeah, it combines quite a lot of genres, but it's blooming addictive. It's so fun. And uh, there's a horse playing hide and seek on this main screen. Anyway, we're going to continue our run. We're at moon 15 and that's basically day 15. So I'm just going to hit pause and we're going to try and work out where we were before exactly. Ah oh, yes, we were making lots and lots of sheds because sheds allow us to keep more cards. So up here shows how many cards we have and how many cards we can hold at the end of the day so when this bar on the right moon 15 once that moves to the end of the day if we have more than 60 cards we're gonna have to bin some of them uh, this shows how much food we have we have so much food so therefore it might be worth trying to get extra villagers now let's just sort of get everything in order so we've got a big stack of apples we've got other types of food well we've only got a carrot and an egg but you know our coins are there as we sell cards and things you can see they've got little numbers on them that's how much each one is worth and then we can use them to buy other packs of cards which you have along the top here All right and then i've unpaused now we can we can take our villagers we can plonk them on certain things you can see as this bar goes up it means we're going to get resources that pop out so out of a tree a villager is going to make us a bit of wood and we can use that wood to go on a stone and a stick because this is like a recipe sort of thing we worked out and we can put our villager on there and he should turn that into another shed which we can stack on our very tall multi-story shed so we can store even more cards uh, meanwhile i've got these two over here that one's in a quarry that one's in a mine and as you can see they're getting us stone and iron ore and stuff we need to work out how to make iron bars i think that's like that's sort of where we got to in terms of recipes oh shed over there uh, we also need to make sure we have food as well so i'll put this guy on the apple tree that will give us some apples so i'll probably just put that there and then i'm going to put an apple in the soil because that will plant another apple tree and we get the soil back and then at the end of moon 15 we have to feed all of our thing i think each villager takes two bits of food so this stack will go down by six. Oh I mean, yeah, I'm going to work on a house and get a new villager, I think. So in ideas, we should have recipe for a house. Yes, bottom left, we need two woods, one stone and a villager. So there's a wood, there's a stone. We got this guy in the lumber camp getting us some more wood oh but it's the end of the day so let's feed our villagers as i said before they'll all eat two foods each and then we're ready to start the next day because we're under 64 cards all right so there's the wood i'm gonna grab this villager because we have so much stone so you're gonna go on there that's gonna make a house all right okay we have a house so we're gonna grab a villager and grab another villager and then in there oh my goodness that is very very rude i'm glad that's been censored out they are doing their thing and they're making us a little baby and there it is he popped out so the baby stays in the house because he needs to grow into a villager so we can put him to work we don't just work children here uh, and meanwhile i think we need to work on some sort of money production so i'm going to take three stone and i'm going to put that villager on the three stone that will make us a brick and bricks are worth a little bit of money because i have just noticed if i hover over these cards look at the bottom left it tells you everything that's in each one and more importantly if you hover over ones like this may contain one undiscovered card so there's still a card to find in that so i don't need to buy those two really if i'm trying to find new things that one is only one chance curious cuisine seven undiscovered cards so once we sell that brick we're gonna buy a curious cuisine because this is how we get new cards in the game so let's open this and see what we get we get an egg a stove oh a stove and raw meat what does a stove do stack a brick an iron bar again with the iron bars we don't know how to make iron bars it's the end of another day they should all get fed uh, we still got loads of food left so we're good to start the next day i think we really need to start working on like getting some money because i'm guessing maybe we need to get in the logic and reason pack so i just need a recipe to turn our iron ore into iron bars although could it be a brickyard i don't know what else have we got i haven't actually checked all these things i reckon it's going to be that one anyway look our baby is about to grow up he's a villager or she could be anything that all right we've got some planks we've got some bricks so we will sell both of those because they're worth five coins each and then we'll drag all these into logic and reason because we got a logic and reason pack so a tree a brick a rock and oh an animal pen oh i can finally my cow has been going mental like escaping two planks two wood and oh one iron bar i don't know how to make an iron bar unless it's not just three iron ore is it because that's how you make like planks and stuff right it might be so I've put someone in the mine if it is just that i'm gonna be so annoyed <laughs> you know what? let's sell our bricks let's sell our planks oh god oh god the there's loads of people. We gotta, we gotta attack. We gotta attack. There's goblins. That tree's freaking out as well. What are you guys doing? Attack. All right, there you go. I think we killed him. We outnumbered them. 
you. Right, everyone back to work where they were. Bloody hell. So sometimes portals appear and portals contain like enemies. And when you kill an enemy, you get poo. Uh, we did also get three coins, which I won't complain about. Next, I'm going to buy another logic and reason pack. And do I have enough to buy a curious cuisine? Yeah, I do. Nice. All right, two new cards down here. Cow going mental. Stop pushing my apples about. Still haven't got the iron ore yet. Anyway, let's open the curious cuisine. We get an onion. Ooh, a frittata. We need a campfire, an egg, and a potato. Oh, I haven't seen a potato yet. That's on the to-do list. Meanwhile, in this pack, we've got a rock, a plank, a berry bush, and ooh, a temple. Let me guess, you need iron bars. Yep, you need iron bars. I feel like I'm unlocking everything apart from iron bars. Right, anyway, we finally have three iron ore, so let's grab this villager. Oh, I didn't do it. It didn't do it. Well, that's right then. I did figure like we probably need a building. Um, how do we unlock these next packs? If I hover over them, does that actually tell me? Oh, complete one more quest to unlock this pack. Five more quests. Okay, so we need to go into the quests. Get interrupted by the end of the day. Feed my villagers. All right, eat up, guys. There are four of you now, so that's quite a lot of food that we're losing each time. Uh, but back in the quests, we can scroll down, find the catacombs. We can train militia, which we haven't done yet. We can also cook some meat. We haven't cooked meat yet. We haven't had three. Why would you build more houses? Houses. Having 10 wood is also an easy one. <laughs> Let's train some militia then. So I think we need to craft a spear and I believe that was two sticks and a block of wood. There you go. That's doing something. I think that's going to make us a spear. Yeah, that's right. And then two sticks and an iron bar will create a sword, but we can't make iron bars yet. There's the spear. So if I put that on a villager, I think they'll combine together into a militia, which means we've unlocked the explorer's pack. Oh, nice. So they're basically the same, but they have more, more health. And bottom left, there's all sorts of stats. I assume they're just like better at attacking as well. Decent. All right, maybe I'll do that with all my people then. I'll turn woods into sticks and give them all spears. Meanwhile, we got to keep planting apple trees. That is the key to survival. And then we've definitely got enough coins to go and buy an explorer's pack. I'm excited. All right, so let's open this up. There's only three cards in it, but it's a rock. Oh, great, a rock. It's a bit. It's a bit. It's got 10 health. Is it going to attack my cow? Oh, God. Right. Let's get the spear of my villager. We might need them. We're going to need a load of people to battle this. Oh, there's a bear. I didn't want this. All right, two militia. Let's grab this villager as well. Sorry, Mr. Bear, you're being attacked. There you go. Four on one. He isn't going to last long. He gave us a bone. I'm going to give everyone spears, I think. Anyway, at the end of the day, everyone gets fed and their health goes up because that bear did ruin us a little bit. And oh, what's this? A traveling cart appeared. Give me five coins and I'll give you an item. Oh, Interesting. Okay, we'll leave you up there for now because uh, I got a pack to open. So the Explorer's pack, we've... Oh, just plain. What the hell? What is that? Why is it purple? It's pink. The Great Outdoors may contain... Is this another pack? Or oh, do I send someone? Oh, we're exploring the plains. Ooh, okay, that's cool. That is cool. Meanwhile, two sticks and a wood. That's making a spear. That will be for this bloke over here. So I'll take you off. I'll put you on the mine instead. There's the spear. Go on the villager. I still don't know how to make an iron bar. <laughs> Tell you what though, I might give the traveling cart five coins. And oh, I gave us a spear. We don't actually need a spear. I guess I could save it in case I make another baby in my house. Oh, look, we got extra soil. Okay, we finally got extra soil. That is very, very good. So one will be used to make the next apple tree, which I've got this guy sorting out. However, the other soil I'm going to use for a recipe because I remember seeing one. Yeah, the garden. One soil, two stone and two wood. So there's two wood. There's two stone. So we just got to shove a villager on there and then that will get us a garden, which I don't know what it does, but I didn't want to waste my only soil before. Anyway, let's feed our villagers. Eat up, chaps. Uh, we have one card too many at the moment. So what are we going to sell? A lump of stone or something? That'll do. All right, start the next day. Oh, we haven't built a market yet, have we? Oh, what the hell? There's a chicken. Why do we have a chicken suddenly? Where did he come from? Did our two eggs turn into a chicken? Anyway, there's the garden. So now I assume we can just put someone on that. Oh, no. No, we can't. Why didn't that do anything? Ah, oh, okay. I've added a carrot to the garden. Let's see what it does, I guess. Oh, there's a wolf. There's a wolf. Pause. I don't know where that wolf came from. Oh, did it come from the plains? I think the guy came back out the way, chicken. I think the guy came back from the plains and all he found was a wolf. Well, let's get four blokes on him. All right, there you go. We've got some raw meat. I'll tell you what, I might use that to cook some food because that is a quest I haven't done yet. I literally haven't cooked meat. So we're trying to find some flint. So I might open a humble beginnings pack. There's packs everywhere here. It's gone a bit mental. All right, let's open the humble beginnings pack. We need some flint. We need some flint. No, there's a rat. <laughs> all right, the rat is dead. That's good. Let's open curious cuisines. We've got milk. We've got, oh, fruit salad recipe. Yeah. Yummy, yummy. Apple and a berry. Oh, I can do that. Easy. So there's an apple and a berry. I wonder if that's going to be worth doing. Apples are worth two. Berries are worth one. Oh, that's worth five. 
That is cash. Do I have any other berries? No, I don't have any other berries. Anyway, let's sell the fruit salad. Yummy, yummy. Everyone's eaten and we have 11 cards too many. Oh, we need to we need to start building more sheds. Oh, and by the way, the garden's done. I think it just doubles whatever you put in it. So as you put a carrot in, we got a carrot out. So uh, that's good to know, I guess. All right, let's sell the fruit salad recipe. That literally does nothing for us. Let's get some order going. Let's get some order. All right, it might be worth making another baby. So I'll put those two in there. Right, I still got 10 cards too many. Let's sell my planks, sell my stone, and then sell a bit of wood. And then we're good to start another round. Okay, sweet. All right, the baby popped out. Let's get these guys doing some stuff. All I need is you to find some flint, really. I just want to cook that meat. Oh, look, we found some soil in the plains. So we could build another garden. Because the good thing about them is we can make food without using a person. This apple tree method, we have to use a person every time. So two stone. We just need one more wood on there, which this guy should be making for us. Plop, there it goes. So the wood on there, we shove this guy on there. That will make a garden. And then we can perhaps save some room up here with this soil if we turn that into a garden as well. We're just going to have loads of gardens. Oh, there's a flint. Finally. Okay, so we need a block of wood so we can make sticks, so we can make fire. You know what's going on. All right, so now we have six cards too many. Let's sell some stone and I guess four of our iron. It's got to go, isn't it? And then the other thing I want to build is a market. We haven't built a market yet. One brick, one plank three coins. So we'll get our coins ready. There's a wolf. There's a wolf. Attack the wolf. All right, he's gone. We've got more raw meat, but we have our wood. So once that comes out as a stick like that, we can put that on the flint. That will make a campfire. We can finally cook the meat. And meanwhile, the baby turned into a villager. So let's give him a spear. Literally just grown up and already sent to the army. And up here in our gardens, we're going to go with the apples and the carrots. And move apples over there. So they should just jump onto that stack. All right, and there's our campfire. Raw meat on there. That's finally a quest we need to do. We're making another garden down here as well. I'll tell you what, let's get some packs going. Let's do an explorer pack again. So in here, we have a berry bush a oh crap a giant rat and another plane all right we've got to attack the giant rat come on guys come on guys everyone get involved everyone get involved even you chicken get involved <laughs> right we've millered him it's raw meat now cool look cooked meat all right it's the end of another day i'm a bit worried our food might go down really quick now we've got five mouths to feed uh, we still have nine too many cards i'm gonna have to start building some sheds pronto uh, i might sell the planes again i don't know do i want that many planes yeah i've sold it i'm gonna sell a load of eggs and then we're good to go although a strange portal just appeared so we know some enemy is gonna jump out of that at some point oh look we have a quest to cook an omelet so i assume i just shove an egg on the campfire so once we've cooked that meat holy crap the portal exploded with loads of big things right pause 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 so we've got a bear a giant rat another bear and some slime All right we're gonna have to be careful here matt we don't want to lose everything we've got so i think we'll try and attack this bear first as he's on his own All right that bear's dead let's attack the slime oh god oh god the others are closing in the others are closing in oh no now there's three slimes it's okay they're down they're down right now the giant rat i think this is the key to battling you just gotta pause and make sure everyone attacks at once oh god oh god it's four on two but they're big yes Yes, my militia, our engineers, right? Press balls, right? Let's sort everything out. We've got a right mess of cards. But you're going to have to wait till next time to see how we got on because we're leaving it there for today, guys. Peace, love, and loads of animals that are trying to kill me. Bye.